On today's video, I'm going to show you how to crop an image within your text to create a cool effect like this for your web designs. And guess what? It's going to take you about a minute. Let's rock and roll. Hey everybody, what is up? So recently I saw this design and it was pretty cool that they use kind of a text that has a different image from the background image. And this is used by something that's called CSS masking. So they're using the text itself to use to use it actually as a mask for an image. And I wanna show you how you can achieve that effect in Webflow really, really easily. All right, so let me jump into Webflow and see what I've set here. So basically I have a website and in it, I've dropped in some text, all right? So this is basically just a text, but I did something to it. I gave it a style, I called it a text with background and I've added a background image to it. So I've added this car here as a background for the text itself. And this is how the end result looks like within Webflow. And I've did this a couple more times just so we can see different examples. However, then I've added a little bit of custom code, which you can copy and paste from below this video, which is just this four lines. So this four lines of custom CSS basically means that take text with background, which is the style that I used right here on the right, and then add these two properties to it. So text fill color is gonna be transparent, and then background clip is going to be the text, which basically sets the text to be kind of like the mask. Now let me go ahead and publish this and show you how this looks like. So bam, now the end result is that we have the text, which is live text. This is not an image, right? This is dynamic. I can change this within Webflow and we have the image as a background and we can use, you know, the normal animation to move this around or interact with this. Now, let me show you something cool. Now, if we go back here and go into the background image, I can reposition the image just like I reposition any background image and I can also make this background image fixed. Now what fix will do will make this image in the same position no matter where I scroll. Now this will give us a pretty cool effect and I think this is actually what they use here. So here the background image is fixed and the text of the word stops moves from left to right. So I have went ahead and published the website and let's open it up. And notice now when I'm scrolling, the image of the car stays in place and the text itself as a mask is moving as we're scrolling. And you can see this happening in all these other examples as well. So as you can see, this is so, so simple to use the text itself as a mask. And you can really be creative like the example that we have here from Tubic on Dribbble so that you can create really, really amazing effects with it. So the text, really simple custom CSS code is below this video along with these links that I showed you here so that you can use it yourself, be creative and use Webflow to do amazing things. I'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye.